Welcome to this session from Indira Gandhi National Open University, Center of Kochi. Uh, at the outset, we also acknowledge the contribution of uh, Dr. B. Sukumar, Regional Director, Igno Regional Center, Trivandrum, for facilitating this live session. Uh, this is uh, uh, a highlight of the certificate programs of Igno. Uh, how it will add on uh, to the uh, qualification earned in the job market. So this is what we are going to share. And uh, this is this session will be in English. And this Gandhi National Open has been established by the Act of Parliament. And it has the national jurisdiction and also has an international set to cater to the needs of the learners. Uh, if you are a type who are keen to add on the qualification, you should be very happy that the degree diploma certificates issued are recognized by all member of institution of the Association of Indian Universities. There are far with that the degree diploma certificate issued by all Indian universities. Also the first to open in the country to have been accredited with the A plus right? but we always share when uh, when it comes to the uh, a, the Indira Gandhi National uh, Open University has the objective to democratize higher education by taking it to the doorstep of the learner by providing access to high quality education to those who seek it irrespective of age, region, religion, it offer a need-based academic program by giving professional and vocational orientation to the courses, promoting and developing this education. In don't have the feeling that only if you are distance to education, you have to end up in distance. Whatever education you have lost so far, or you want to acquire to add on to your qualification in of the best means to acquire such educational qualification. So what are the things you can study at IGNU? They are the undergraduate programs, postgraduate programs, diploma programs, PG diploma programs, PG certificate programs, uh, certificate program, and appreciation or post programs. So when it comes to certificate programs, they are very short in duration and it's mainly we have around 69 courses. So uh, certificate programs on offer for every session and you cannot say that uh, nothing is suitable for me. So we have the certificate in library and information science, certificate in disaster, certificate in environmental studies, Certificate program on life and thought of Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. Certificate in peace studies and conflict management. Certificate in food and nutrition. Certificate in nutrition and child care. Certificate in rural development. Certificate in guidance. Certificate in information. Certificate in mobile application development. Certification teaching of English as a second language. Certificate in functional English. Certificate in Urdu language, certificate in human rights, certificate in consumer, certificate in cooperation, cooperative law and business, certificate in anti trafficking, certificate in international human humanitarian law, certificate in NGO, certificate in business, certificate in communication and IT, certificate, uh, advanced certificate in security. The certificate in fashion design, certificate in tourist studies, certificate in laboratory techniques, certificate program in teaching of primary school mathematics, certificate in HIV and family education, certificate in social work and criminal justice system, certificate in tribal studies, certificate in sericulture, certificate in organic farming, certificate in uh, water harvesting and management. Certificate in poultry farming, certificate in beekeeping, certificate in Arabic language, certificate in French language, certificate in Russian language, Arabic, Japanese language, Korean language, the Spanish language, German language, the Persian language, and then certificate in first aid, 
certificate program in yoga, certificate in healthcare based math, certificate in newborn and infant, certificate in mental, maternal and child health nursing, certificate in home based healthcare, certificate in gender, certificate in geriatric care, certificate in clitotomy uh, assistance, that is uh, drawing blood samples and uh, certificate in home health assistance, certificate in community health, certificate in adolescent health and counseling, certificate in visual heart, painting, applied heart, theater heart, in music, Karnatak music, Bardhanatya, and certificate in uh, energy technology and math, and certificate of competency in power distribution. This is for electrical technicians. Certificate in solid waste treat and certificate program in value uh, education, uh, certificate in solid waste management, certificate in community radio, certificate in gender, uh, agriculture, and sustainable development, and communicative Sanskrit. So we have around 69 uh, certificate programs offered in both January and July cycle of admission at Indira Gandhi National Open. The minimum month is six and up to maximum years you can fetch this program for completion after accessing to the program. What one should know for joining a program of study is also a concern when it comes to choosing course. So you first uh, is what will choose like you. See many a time we go after course which by us. But what are the courses which by, uh, by you meaning? See, so, suppose you are an extrovert, some public relations skill uh, management or uh, spoken language that will be used. But if you are a person who are in back office, then you have to add on to the qualification which will suit the job instead of uh, uh, moving from the job. So uh, that is why we always say it's better to say the wind. So first you know the program details. Program details will tell you the title, what is the main content and what is the objective of the course? And the title of the course will also will tell you what are the uh, various subjects it has to be covered in a program and how many courses has to be studied. And credit is the value for each of the course. And the course code is the short form or the abbreviation for the title of the course in a program. And the eligibility criteria also you need to before joining a program of study. And uh, in certificate program of IGNO, mainly the qualification is 10 plus 2 or equivalent. However, th there are programs which do not have any qualification, like the CFN. And there is only eight passes needed for poultry farming. And eight pass are prof or, uh, professional beekeepers can be doing CIB. And uh, 10 plus 2 or 18 years of age is needed for CAL, CFL, C, that is the Arabic, French, and the Persian language. And adult pass with 10 plus 2 is C, and 10th pass uh, uh, out or non 10 plus uh, 10th pass having two years experience of sericulture with the experience certificate from the extension officials from the Department of Sericulture, Agriculture Extension recognized NGO industry that is for sericulture and 10 passes needed for these programs CWHM, CFAID, THC, CAP, THP, CPA, HM, AAKM, CA. All these certificate programs have been sharing, isn't it? And certain programs, of course, they need bachelor's degree, that is the CRD, rural development, and social welfare and justice system, CSWC. Graduation of three years of the uh, BAEA or the two years PTT or ET or 10 plus 2 with years teaching experience is needed for others uh, certificate in teaching. And any graduate or 10 plus 2 with five years of experience the related field is for anti-human trafficking certificate. 10 plus 2 or matriculate with at least 3 years of work experience 
geo sector is needed for the CNM and ten plus two or ten standard with two or uh, three years diploma or equivalent is needed for CMAD. And teachers of recognized institute of course in matriculation or SSC is needed for certificate guidance CIC. So uh, and I was I'm we are talking about the various uh, eligibility criteria. Basically, they ask for 10 plus 2. That's what I want to highlight. And 10 plus 2 with English as one of the subjects is needed for CCITSK, CRUL, CJL, CKLC, CSLC. 10 plus 2 with science subject or equivalent or pass in higher secondary. Science subject or equivalent and one year of experience of working in a college, university, science laboratory. Or 10 plus 2 are equivalent with science subjects and two year experience of working in a, a school or college, university, science like laboratory is needed for CPLT, that is certificate program in laboratory tech. 10 plus 2 for in service person, uh, personnel with minimum three years service or any other degree for uh, pressure is needed for CCLPL. And the 10th pass or SSC or DLC from Microsoft. Or equivalent is needed for CI certificate in teacher who are teaching primary, middle, secondary, or higher secondary school or any graduates can get in. Ten plus two with science needed for CGA, CP, CHHA, and GNM and BSc nurse post basic BSc nurses the practitioners AMS or eligible. Enrolled for CCH. The registered nurse and registered midwife with diploma in general nursing and midwifery or BSc nursing or above can get into CNIM. Continuing the program of six or in service teachers, uh, sorry, in service nurses of ANM, RN, uh, RM is eligible to get into CMCH. And electrical practitioners for equivalent tradesmen or uh, uh, manpower working in electric power sector. Adults, 8th pass onwards, or candidate having 10th or 12th or degree or diploma or ITI are eligible for CCT. Why this promotional meeting? Why it will be easy to share with you the need for continuing education? The continuing education is something that as your age increases, your experience But are you in touch with the recent developments or are you have you recently acquired any add-on programs matter a lot when you climb up the career ladder? So need for continuing education is in. Why to continuing education is not only for your peers or your seniors or sometimes your competitors, it is to keep you to say that you are an ever uh, lasting learner so that you can you are teachable. You are also telling that you are teachable to the viewers who see the uh, profile of yours and also to see that there is something progressive when it comes to education. That's why they always say that education is something you cannot donate. You have to earn it. So for example, if you want so, somebody wants some money, somebody can help them. But somebody wants one degree, we cannot lend our degree to you. Also, our education is something that it has a power when it comes to a, to value an individual in a job market. And importance of lifelong learning is also a very concern because many of the institutions or the job in which we are placed is very key that the employees are continuously learning, keeping them up, uh, updated, not only in the field for which they are working, but also in the associated fields. And uh, anywhere or anytime education is also a very keen thing. So whenever you want to study and amidst your job commitments, your social and family commitments, you, are, you can study in the distance. Distance learning system is so flexible that uh, it provides a platform that within the minimum period of study, either you can complete it or you can stretch it to the maximum period of study. So, uh, so that your access into the program of study 
is always ensured with successful program. And IGNU as a distance education provider is also a concern. And he, uh, as I have been sharing the profile, it is uh, one of the institutions whose the certificates are recognized. And the features of IGNU is also flexible to accommodate anyone and everyone into the fold for the need of education. When to apply is also a matter. So when it comes to uh, when to apply, it is also a concern that uh, you have to apply only on. And now is the time. And uh, for this January 2020, uh, the 10th February is the last day. You have to apply in the online uh, only. There's no offline mode. But what are the life skills needed for education? You have to be honest. Take one day at a time. Many a time, uh, we uh, do not understand why we are studying. Sometimes we put uh, our qualifications within bracket behind our name, and we do not uh, put our efforts to successfully complete it. So be honest of why you are enrolling and whether you are keen to finish it matters a lot uh, when it comes to the successful completion. It is over only when you give up and take one day at a time. It matters a lot because many a time you are coupling the study with other commitment also. And do not worry about uh, tomorrow. So because why we are sharing this that you should not about tomorrow. That every day sometimes something has to do. Many a time when you look fr uh, from today the to tomorrow, it will be certain. But when the tomorrow becomes today, it will be take one day at a time. Plan for one day. That is enough for us to move on. And think of the spin-off benefits. Yes, I have challenges. I have my leisure time activity. I have the hobbies to do. I have my job commitment, social commitment, my personal family commitment. But still, what are the spin-off benefits if I complete the program of study? If that comes to your mind, that will be one of the push factors for you to head and uh, uh, to uh, uh, leading to the successful completion of the program of study. Please visit our YouTube uh, channel also. And if you have further queries, please visit rccoaching.ac.in. With this, uh, we have come to the uh, concluding session of certificate programs of IGNU. Uh, uh, we have uh, seen that there are 69 certificate programs, and the minimum criteria is eight pass or an adult. And depending upon the quality, uh, the content of the program, the qualification, uh, eligibility qualification, also uh, moves to up to graduate level. And some programs are only for the paramedical staff. So with this, I just want to end this session with a small thought. A king will be no way in but an educationist or somebody who knows wherever he goes. Even a rich man, he may lose all his possessions. By giving or uh, by donating uh, all is well. Whereas, if you keep on uh, sharing or donating what you know, education wise, only will enhance. So, whatever you do, it take one day at a time. And you, above all, there is something called we always tell emotional quotient or emotional cultural intelligence. It also come to a uh, aspect of spiritual intelligence. So please depend on God amidst all the situation. And what is suitable for you uh, will definitely be useful for your career. So with this thought of uh, that education has been of benefits, educationists or people who have the education qualification will be recognized everywhere they go. And also, above all, depend upon the so amid so many uncertainties, please depend on God to guide you and you because each one is unique and there is no way to economy. With this, please uh, join us again uh, with another session.
you also having in reach and we look forward for more sessions with you all.